to Kitchen Instruments. Now today is going to be a bit of an exciting video because I'm going to show you a technique that I used in my most recent cooking contest entry. So today I'm going to show you guys how to make a fluid gel. So let's get to it. Okay, so let's take a minute to talk fluid gels. Now, what is a fluid gel exactly? Well, a fluid gel is just a food science-y way of achieving a better, or maybe a better term, a more versatile puree. And I'll explain it like this. Okay, traditionally when you make a puree, you just blend something up and ta-da, you're done. But it's never going to be as fine as you want, and you also can't add certain flavor components to it without running the risk of thinning out the puree, and thereby making it really hard to plate. So, that's where fluid gels come in. Now, we're going to get over that little hurdle of making our puree too thin by adding gelatin. And what that gelatin does is exactly what gelatin does. It turns things into a gel. Now, what we're going to do is, as the mixture's cooling, or even after it's done cooling, is we're going to either put it in a standing or use a stick blender to re-blend it up and make it a puree again. And that's what's going to give us our texture that we're after. All right, now I know you might be asking yourself, you might be asking, is this really a necessary technique to learn? Do I need to even waste my time learning this? And the reality is probably not, but I've always found that it's always good to have more information and more tools in your culinary tool bag than not, because you never know what you're going to run into. And it's always nice to learn how to fix stuff. And as always, if you enjoyed this week's video, please feel free to give it a like and also share it because it really does help this channel grow by helping it reach a broader audience. And also, if you're a real fan of the show, feel free to subscribe so you get notifications each time a new show comes out, which is usually about two or three times a week. All right, so who's ready to dabble in the art of fluid gel making, huh? Eh, it's really simple. It's essentially just making jello and then blending that jello up into a liquid again. It's really what it is. And that's how easy it is to make a fluid gel. Now, the flavor combinations are pretty much endless, so you know, explore, have fun. The only thing you might run into a problem with is pineapple, because pineapple actually has an enzyme that eats protein, and that's what gelatin is, is protein. All right, well, that's all I have time for today. Stop by later in the week when I'm going to be making homemade pizza dough by hand. No machines required. Don't need any of them fancy gadgets. See you then.